More Funray Electronics, this time Project 6, an electronic siren. Just two transistors, a speaker, LED and a few other parts. Here's the completed siren. Moment of truth, just apply power and see what happens. There's two connections, basically switches. This is called the siren probe. You can see the LED turned on. Now if I hold the probe down, it's interesting, and I held it down for too long, it paused a bit. And there's what's called the stop probes. Now we'll try, I'll just lick my fingers and try some higher resistance across the probes. And it builds up a bit slower. The thing about these sorts of circuits is that if you change the component values you can also change the sound. And According to the book, it says you should be able to reproduce the rail of a fire engine very closely. If you want to experiment, there are three components you could try to altering seeing what effects you can get. 47k resistor and both the capacitors, the 0.1 and the 100 microfarads. So, let's see what happens if we Try a smaller value of resistor for the 47K. In this case, here I've got a 4.7K. Well, that went, that charged up the capacitor very quickly. So, yeah, so that's to lower value. I will just change this capacitor value instead of 100 nanofarad, just put in 10. Now this is very different. It's quieter, but it goes up much higher. But I do think this sounds more like a real siren. Now I'll just try my finger test again. Because it's a higher resistance, it's taking longer to go up and then it's going up slower. If you wanted to get a medium 
pitch sound then something like 22 or 47 nanofarad would be a good middle value. Something else I should mention with these sirens or any small project is that the worst thing you can do is just to have the speaker on its own. If you can put it in a box then that will give you much better volume. Okay, now we've just got 10 microfarad here instead of 100. It's a lot quicker. Just curious about this LED here. Now what happens if you short the LED out? Interestingly enough, the volume is actually less but it's shorted out. Now what if we short out this 68 ohm resistor here? Now that's become much louder. It's causing more current to go through the transistor, but I doubt it will exceed its rating as I'm only using a 9 volt battery here. But that's the electronic siren. Only a handful of parts. I'm not sure how real it sounds, but it would have given a kid hours and hours of fun. Just building it and pulling it apart and rebuilding it using different parts. It's Funway 1, project number 6.